Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's out and about, about to go spend some time with the Shem. So, you know, I guess I can't remain silent on it because everybody's been asking me. Not that I wanted to remain silent. It's just sort of like, you know, not my thing to always talk about these type of things. But everybody's been asking about the Ben Shapiro, a song with Tom McDonald. Ben's my boy. I am friends with Ben. I, I talked to Ben about it. The first objection I have was that if you're going to start rapping as a year and you don't call me, then we got problems. Number two is let's talk about the content of the song. As a person who was raised on hip-hop let's be straight now listen we know we got this problem in hip-hop that we talk about i say we because i'm not in that world anymore but i come from it i used to talk about disrespecting women one of the things that's been so, so striking to me to see all these rappers talib kwali who i've had nothing but love for my mama grew up on talib i love talib you know he helped me out of gangster rap no doubt about it he was one of those ones that i was able to say that listen there's somebody who's doing it who has passion, who's able to make songs about something beyond what was going on normally. So for me personally, I took that as a bigger hit when I just seen him, somebody sent me a clip of his. Mama's ridiculous. There was nothing racist about the song. The issue, we're all tired of this woke stuff, man. The whole world. And that's why the song went as far as it went because everybody's tired of it. It's not just them. There's a lot of us. We're tired of this overly progressive poison that's poisoning the whole entire world. And I'm happy somebody said something. I just didn't think Ben would say it in a rap. I would have to say congratulations to Ben at least for charting as well as he is and I'm thankful that somebody said something. People need to start speaking out against this stuff. It's destroying the fabric of society. It's destroying everything. All this wokeness. So I'm happy somebody said something. I just have to say this because what's bothering me another thing is too is the hypocrisy you know what i mean where's talib on all these other guys talking about whatever they want you know i definitely am not hearing any backlash towards this tune core they said told them that they didn't allow them to release the song because of offensive lyrics i mean come on now offensive lyrics those were offensive lyrics compared to what we're dealing with in the hip-hop world today how many of these kids are overdosing and on drugs because they're listening to rappers talk about doing drugs the hypocrisy of everything. This is just like the Black Lives Matter hat. Every black life that's killed by a white person matters, but every black person who's killed by another black person, that don't matter when that's what's happening in the majority. So Ben Shapiro and Tom McDonald's song, that one matters, but your own brother who's making songs about killing this one and that one and everything else, that's not what we're talking about. Like, I mean, come on, man. We've been talking like this for years. Talib's been talking about the black problem for years. You know, like somebody had made an argument. You can't say all that in front of all these white folks even if you feel that way it's like hold on man if you rap it about it a guy like talib who talks about black issues all the time in his music or at least he did i haven't listened to him in many years now the majority of your fans are white so are you only addressing black people no you're not you're saying all these issues about what's going on in the black community to white people just like larry elder is just like other black conservatives i think this is getting out of control guys let's stop faking it could be okay to talk about killing and shooting one another but we can't critique the way that we're addressing social issues over the last few years. That's, you know, that's going too far. That's selling out. I mean, come on, man. This is crazy. Something's got to change.